A seventh grader and his family blame a teacher for a brutal brawl that ended with six Port St. Lucie students arrested. The family talking to News Channel 5's Brian Nitton. He joins us now with the story. Yeah, right now the St. Lucie County School District is not speaking out. Uh, the teachers union is not comment commenting and neither is the teacher who hasn't been charged with anything at this point. But the 13 year old victim and his attorney say they felt they had to speak out. I looked at him and I was like, are you serious? Rodravius Williams at one point says he was friends with the six classmates police say attacked him at Northport K-8 school. He said that they brought him in the hallway and that they held him down, they kicked him, they stomped him, they beat him. And as he was trying to get away, they just basically like continued to just torture him. Radravius's mom, Latasha, talking to us with her attorney. She admits her son talked back to his teacher, and when he did, she says the teacher directed some of the students to, quote, teach him a lesson. Her remarks was, I got my eighth grade boys on you. You're not so tough now. Six students are under arrest, but the teacher has not been charged and is not mentioned in any of the police reports. Still, the family's attorney says the teacher sparked the attack. I think that the teacher um, needs to be away from children if it is her uh, mode of discipline to send other children to beat up a child. It's like a nightmare. He's not the same. He's, he's had some sleepless nights. Radravius hasn't been back to school since the March 20th fight. He'll start at a new school in the district on Monday. It's been a nice break, but I'm looking forward to going back to school. The district says the teacher has been taken out of the classroom while police continue their investigation. The victim's attorney says at this point they have no plans to sue. At the live desk, Brian Enton, WPTV News Channel 5.